Hello everyone, welcome back. I hope you're having a great day. I hope you've had a great summer. Um, as summer is wrapping down here, I know it's been a little while since I've been on here because I've kind of been just enjoying the end of my summer. I spent some time at the cabin, been doing you know, just stuff around. Um, I had a lot of skating competitions lately with my figure skating students, but it's the end of the summer. In fact, as I'm recording this, tomorrow I go back to my regular full-time job as a high school teacher. So, yeah, I've been spending time in the cabin doing some stuff like that, spending time with friends and family. But I did want to come back on because I never did my, like, Nordstrom sale haul, basically, and what I got from there. The makeup stuff that I focused on was some stuff that I've been wanting to try, but it is more expensive. So this is going to be some of that since I got it on sale. I'm going to talk about the regular prices of this stuff, but it's basically I got Bobbi Brown, like two things from her that we're going to try today. Um, I finally got some Mac Fix Plus, and then I picked up some candles. I tried to pick up some more candles, but one of them sold out, unfortunately, after it was already in my cart. Like, I purchased it, and then I got an email from them later that by the time they went to place my, or pack my order or whatever, my Volume Spa candles had sold out, and I was very sad about that, because I love those. But, that's okay. We'll get to that. <laughs> um, so, yeah, without further ado... We're gonna put, I have, you know, my main face makeup on. We're gonna put the Bobbi Brown stuff that I have on, give it a mist with my finishing spray that I got, show you the candles, and go from there. So let's go ahead and do it. All right. So, what I picked up was also. I noticed my face makeup looks a little bit darker today. What I have on my face is like what I normally wear. I have my Ilia Super Serum Skin Tint on. And this is the same shade I've been wearing, this 6.5, all summer. I don't know if it just got applied heavier today, but it definitely looks darker today. So I don't know what's going on with that. Um, and then because it was darker, I just put some blush and highlighter from the Real Her palette that I think was in my last video, maybe the one before, I don't remember for sure. One of those. But anyway, um, we're gonna do the, I picked up the Bobbi Brown uh, Longwear Cream Shadow Stick because I love some cream shadow sticks. You know, I love my Thrive ones, I really love my Real Her ones. We're gonna do the Bobbi Brown one. Now, this one is the Mini it was on even more sale so it's it's pretty mini um you know it's it's small this one comes in this is in golden pink and that's the only shade the mini comes in so it's kind of like this rosy shimmery pink i feel like yeah kind of like a rose gold almost so this one only comes in the one shade there are other shades in the full size but only one shade in this. So I'm going to put this on. I'm going to, uh, I don't know. It's really like powerful. I'm going to do my finger. I'll do it like I do with the real hair. Maybe finger and brush. But like it just, whoo, packs a punch. And it is long wearing. Like it definitely is long wearing. I don't know. I like to use my finger with it because it doesn't come off too bad. Like there's some shimmer on that finger. But it's not terrible. We'll try it with a brush though. Give it a little fluffer. Fluffy brush. That's not a real word that I just used, but we're gonna go with it. I don't start going back to, you know, teaching till tomorrow. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, I don't like it with the brush. I'm gonna use my finger so that they're the same. Okay, and then I'm just gonna roll this on. It literally glides on. It feels like a roller ball almost. So it kind of just like rolls on and glides on. So there it is. It definitely packs a punch. Um, you know, I would maybe just do this on my lids normally. Like not the whole lid, just the bottom lid, the lower lid. I don't know where my words are today. To add some oomph, especially for like an occasion or something. You know, I have a lot of weddings I've been going to. It's fun to add some sparkle to that. So, 
anyway there's the eye look um just let you see it a little bit closer in the light but i do i do really like the formula and it does stay on it is long wearing 100 percent we'll give it that so i do really like it it's a nice formula um i'm gonna the other thing that i picked up was the extra lip lip extra lip tint um and i got a, the duo pack from the sale but and so i have two of those that i've been using i'm going to put on my eyeliner i actually have mascara on already we might add more we'll see what i'm feeling and my brows i'm gonna go and do that quickly speed through that and then we'll put the lip on Um, this stuff is literally so shiny that when I was trying to look at myself in the mirror, plus I have, you know, the lights on me and stuff too, but I was struggling, especially on the side to like see, like it was, I don't know, it was just reflecting so much. It was hard to put my eyeliner on. I, I don't know. It was weird, but it's super shiny. There's no doubt about that. My face is a little shiny too. It's apparently warm in here. I don't feel like it's that warm. The Ilya skin tone does get shiny, but I even put on, because it was so much, I put on this banana setting powder from bp it was something i got in, i think an ipsy bag or something um bella pierre that's what it's by i like it but it also like part of the reason i put it on was to like mattify things this morning but also like tone down i don't know i just feel like i got a lot it got really deep but i kind of feel like i want more blush now that i have my eyes on plus i'm using a powder blush so maybe that'll help with the sign shiny shiny situation oh my lord have mercy i don't know what is going on with my words sorry there was a hair on my shirt that was bothering me okay um so this is blessed from the real her palette it's a very peachy color if you haven't seen that video but it's not over the top there that seems better it's still like naturalish all right so I got, <laughs> just threw that one across the room. Good thing that's not the color I wanted to put on anyway. So anyway, <laughs> I should probably grab it to show you though, because that one is the, oh, I have to bear pink because I can look at the box. Um, hold on, please. Okay, I'm back. So anyway, this is bear pink. And this one, it's very sheer almost. Like it literally looks like nothing on my lips. Just gives a nice shine, really nice shine. I just put it on the bottom lip for now. Um, but it definitely adds a nice shine. So that's bare pink. It's super sheer. Oh, okay, this might be weird too, but there's a little bit of pink on you can kind of see maybe like there's a tiny bit of pink on that tissue after I wipe it off, but not much. So super sheer. I'm going to sneeze, but it's really, really nice. <coughs> okay. Um, so anyway, it's really nice. Like formula wise, I like to use this one as kind of almost just like a, you know, glossy balm when I need to. But the other one that I have, I think, is raspberry. Yes, bare raspberry. So this one, and actually, just look at that. We're just going to take a second to look at the packaging. It's a nice white, shimmery white, though, with that black band. I picked up the bare pink again. Try that again. Bare raspberry. Um, this one, I don't know why my lips stick on, you know, why it's curving like that, but it is. 
Um, so this one's more of like a red color in the tube. But it gives my lips like a nice pinkish red raspberry color when it's on my lips. Like it looks really red here, but on my lips it does look raspberry. So again, it's super sheer, glossy. And I really like this formula. That one's been in my purse actually. I had to dig it out of my purse before this because it adds a touch of color, but it also moisturizes my lips. I really like it. It's Bobbi Brown, so it's not, so it's not like crazy expensive, um, but it's also not cheap. But I hate to say, I think it might actually be worth it. So yeah. Anyway, <laughs> you know, if you can get it on sale, that's always great. Um, but I will, you know, have them linked below. I'm going to link them from Nordstrom just because that's where I got it from. And the regular prices are there. But you can always shop around for sales. You know, maybe Nordstrom sale, maybe Sephora sale. You know, we want to put it in your next time then. That's fine. But we are going to finish this look with our MAC Fix Plus setting spray. Um... One of my favorite YouTubers to watch, Khaki from Khaki Reviews Beauty. Or is it Hey Khaki? No, Khaki Reviews Beauty. That one. Um, she swears by this stuff. She loves it. So she, when she had done her, you know, what's in my Nordstrom cart, she had had this in there. Um, because it, I think it was... I don't remember how much it was on sale, but I, it was like one of them basically off. So it's got two of the full size plus a mini travel one. Uh, and I was like, you know what? They're on sale. She swears by them. So I was like, I'm probably gonna love them. I don't really have a setting spray that I like. So I figured I'd try it and I do like it. Um, so let me just, okay, anyway, let me just put this on is what I was going to say. My battery decided to die. Um, so I'm going to just back, you know, I'm going to back up and then we'll spray this. Okay. So I'm going to back up a little bit and honestly, I'll be back here now to kind of run final thoughts, but. Mm. It's got a lovely, I was going to say rose scent and yeah, that's what the box does. Refreshing rose. Um, so it definitely has a everything's falling over on my desk today it definitely has a lovely refreshing rose scent to it and I mean you can see it gives me a little bit of shine but it does soak in nicely um so I really like it I don't use a lot of setting sprays in general but especially when I'm back to school and I want my face to last at least throughout the school day I will probably reach for it a lot more often and I do just really really like the smell of it so that's nice too. All right, um, I'm gonna show you while I'm back here. So like I mentioned in the beginning, I was not able to get my Volume Spa candles. It was a set of like four or five of their, I don't know, I don't know what size of all that's. I think the, I have it sitting over there, but I don't wanna climb over there. Um, but you know, like yay big, I think it was that size. And I was super excited for them. Like, they were half the reason for my purchase because I love those candles, and I didn't get them. Um, but I did pick up the Nest candles. Now, I was expecting these to be a lot bigger. Honestly, I was expecting the little eyeshadow stick thing that I got. You know, the Bobby Brown one to be a lot bigger, too. But it's okay. Um, the stuff was not, you know, it was on sale, so it was totally affordable. But regularly, it's not super cheap, which I think is why I was expecting, you know, a bigger bang for my buck. Um, but I picked up this set of Nest candles. So I'm going to pull them out. It has grapefruit, which I was super excited for because I love grapefruit. Ocean, and, ocean mist and sea salt and bamboo. So, I mean, like, this is, this is the little guy. is the size candle we got um so I don't remember if I mentioned this at the beginning but yes like as I'm holding this stuff my nails are super wonky I've been at the cabin I've been busy I didn't get my nails done 
So they're super wonky. Anyway, this one is the grapefruit and it smells like a fresh grapefruit. Yeah, it smells like a grapefruit. I love it. It's nice and citrusy. Sweet, but not overly sweet. Love it. Ocean Mist and Sea Salt, and they all are in the classic, you know, white stripe from Nest. Based on Nest candles that I've seen in other people's videos. I've never had them. This almost smells like a men's fragrance. I get ocean though. I definitely get ocean from it. And then bamboo. Oh, smells like something. I mean, yes, bamboo, but like, it's just really fresh and like woody. So yeah, I guess bamboo, but it's like a Bath and Body Works scent that it reminds me of. It's stronger, but it's not overpoweringly strong. I don't remember, but they're all good. I am most excited about grapefruit though. Um, I suppose I could read what they say as we go into the final thoughts on these. And I just realized I forgot to check what the price of a set like this would be. I will put it below or maybe on the screen here if I can find the price. If not, it's not there. But if it was there, I found the price. Um, so anyway, the Grapefruit is an exhilarating blend of pink pomelo grapefruit and watery green notes with lily of the valley and coriander blossom that uplifts the senses. Yes, it does. Ocean mist and sea salt. The refreshing essence of a gentle ocean mist is combined with hints of sea salt, white tea, and coconut for a seaside escape. Mm -hmm. I think those two are my favorite scents. Bamboo is nice, but it's not totally my scent. Like grapefruit, 100%, then the ocean, then the bamboo, kind of. Bamboo is a blend of white florals with an abundance of lush green notes and hints of sparkling citrus creates a welcoming aroma. So again, those are the Nest candles. They seem nice. Um, we're going to talk my final thoughts on these Bobbi Brown products and kind of the MAC Fix Plus too, but I'm mostly focusing on those Bobbi Brown products. So let's start with our cream eyeshadow stick. This is the long wear cream shadow stick again in golden pink. This one is 0.03 ounces for the mini, which is $16. The regular is 0.05 ounces, so you get 0.02 ounces more for $32. So double the price. Yeah, double the price for not quite double the product. But um, all right, this one is an ultimate quick stick featuring the brand's Swipe and go cream eyeshadow that glides on with ease for 24 hours of instant effortless eyes. I don't know if it stays on 24 hours. I take my makeup off before then, but it does stay on for quite a while. It definitely packs a punch and it does glide on. I do really like that formula. So if you want to spend that kind of money, go for it. Because I really do like that formula. And honestly, it's not that much more expensive, you know, than the other cream shadow sticks that I use either. I want to say Thrive is 26. I could be wrong. Real Her was right around there. So it's not that much more. And it is really nice. A Dax Punch. All right. How about the extra lip tint? This one. Um, so again, I have it in Bare Pink and Bare Raspberry. They are $34 each individually. Um, they are lightweight, sheer, and ultra moisturizing formula that has all the benefits of your go-to balm plus a color enhancing tint, and it 100% does that. I agree with those claims. So if you're willing to spend $34 on it, you know, I got this set for not that much. I don't know if I'm going to buy it again just because of the amount of money, but it is really, really nice formula. So maybe when it's on sale again, I'll buy it. Because, yeah, it just it is very nourishing, moisturizing, and I do keep my purse. I like to have it. And finally, the MAC Fix Plus. Um, the regular bottle for one bottle is 3.4 ounces for, is 3.4 ounces for $31. Sorry. It is a lightweight, mineral-rich mist that soothes and refreshes skin, delivering an instant boost of hydration while finishing your makeup look. And that it does. It does what it says. I like it. It doesn't feel heavy. It feels totally fine. I've been wearing it for a while. You can see how it's kind of sitting on my face. So there it is. But anyway, those are my thoughts on these things. Oops. 
kicking the camera, sorry. Those are my thoughts on these things. I hope it was helpful. If it was, please give it a thumbs up. If you wanna keep hanging out with me as I do makeup reviews, you know, beauty, things like that, I'd love it if you did. I'd love it if you subscribe to our channel and hang out with me here periodically. So, without further ado, have a great rest of your day or night or whatever time you're watching this. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.